Hi all, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Europa Universe House 4, working on Poland, Canada, and Space. It's Sunday morning, it's a quiet day for me, so I figured I'd get a few episodes in today. Um, I apologize, you can probably hear my coffee coming in and out, um, but I need it, it's the morning. So when we last left off, we were debating about what idea slot to get. And to be honest, it has to be a military one because of how far along we are in military versus the other techs. There's no point in getting admin, even though I want economic. Um, and I was debating about this, and I think I'm just going to go for quality. Uh, the problem with quality is, of course, these three naval ones I don't really care about. Um, but it's good overall. It's a balanced one. I'm not sure if I'm going to be aggressive or not, so I, I think the... Um, the quality here is going to be nice. So we're going to pick up quality as our next one. Hopefully we'll finish Aristocratic pretty soon here. Um, and we'll go from there. So, let's see here. We're actually pretty close to getting the next tech in military. We are three years ahead. Um, the same here, here of Diplo. So, anyway, we'll start it going. We're in a nice little quiet area. We're slowly working to keep up. We have a lot of diplomats now, four of them. These guys are our vassals. These guys won't vassal yet, um, but we're going to keep on making sure they like us. Um, I'm not sure why there, there's a, there were some Claiming Thrones incidents. I was really asleep the last time I was playing this, so you may have noticed some terrible, terrible plays. We're going to try to lower those a little bit, um, but here we go. People want to be our allies. Let me figure out who they are. Let's see here. Saxony and Brandenburg. Brandenburg is really tiny. Are they still the... So it's getting to the point where it might be actually useful. The problem is still Austria. They're allied with Bavaria and Hansa. Who are their enemies? Bohemia, Cologne, Friesland, Brandenburg, Ulm, Hesse. Brandenburg's their rival. Brandenburg's rivals don't really matter. Okay. I'm thinking about finally accepting the Saxony one. I may regret that, but it seems like an interesting play, because then we can work our way here. Otherwise, I mean, Brandenburg is tiny. We could... We already have a royal marriage. We could ally with them. Um, I think they are still the, the Roman Empire. Yeah. So I wouldn't be able to take them over or anything, but... Mm -hmm. How long was they going to get attacked? Let's just accept the Saxony one. Our stability is really low. There's not a lot that I want to spend money on right now. And our uh, revolt risk isn't that bad, really. So, that's good. How's our monetary situation going? Ten a turn, okay. We can continue with our efforts to create um, money-making buildings, which isn't bad. We are fully religious unity, so that's good. Are we royal married? Are we allied? We are royal married. Oh, right, because I royal married right at the end there, and I should have just gone after him. That's right. I'm remembering how poorly I played the last time. Made many mistakes. That's really the theme of this, is me making mistakes. And you guys, if you're watching, you're getting to laugh at me, make silly mistakes. Um, so. Brandenburg, Friesland, Bohemia. I'm not worried about any of them. Bohemia is, I guess, a little big, but we match them in tech, basically. I mean, I'm Eastern, but that's fine.
Don Sig still has the d disputed succession. Oop, we can build a building. How old is your king? 30. Embassy, March, Fine Arts, those would all be nice. Farm Estate, yeah, all the estates, but I'm most worried about those. So Constables, I don't care about Armories right now, so really it's just Constables. Where can I put Constables that are best? Slowly but surely, Constables everywhere. Bohemia. Autosave is being really slow today. I've actually have been having issues with Steam all day today, and it looks like we lost an advisor. That's great. Moldovia, Krakow, and Friesland. Okay. Krakow is the one that we need to take over, um, but we can't do that for a while. Let's see here. Alliance action. No. Can't do that for another three years, so we will. We need 46, okay. The only good thing here is that our leader is now really good at uh, admin. It's like a five, I think, in admin, so we're, we're getting a decent amount. Um, what would happen? When this guy gets back, what would happen if I declare war on you? <laughs> I would lose three stability, but I'm already at minus one stability. So I'm already at minus two, so I don't think I can go below minus three. Let's actually send a diplomat and. Fabricate a claim. Just, I feel like we want that to take that over, and it may be now that we're already at minus two, worth the stability hit to to take it. Our revolt risk is still not that bad, so think about it. Denmark still allied with people that I don't want them to be with? Yes. Bosnia? Yes. Sweden, I wish you and Russia would stop being buddies. <laughs> now there's a way to move this. Some settings. Uh, message settings. Well, that's how we set which ones we get. There's going to be a way to move. Game options? Game. Loading chart tags, hint. Mm -hmm. There is some way to move this so it's on the bottom. I don't know what that is. I'll figure it out later when I'm not on video. Let's get another advisor. We need the prestige anyway, so that's great. More points for us. Um, and we're at max here. I really wish I should just take it from Moldovia. So annoyed by that. My missions are stuff that I can't do yet, like integrate Krakow. Yeah, I would love to integrate Krakow. Three more years, guys. Spread our culture to Stettin, which I don't want to spend money on, or points on, excuse me. We are at max manpower, so that's good. How are we on units? We could build three more. Which is probably going to be Cav. 
then I should start building my army back up, or my navy back up, which I haven't had for a while. This is what happens. Okay. <laughs> Malovia is going to be even more mad at me. Can you just have your king die? Maybe how old is your king? Yeah. And the days I wish I could assassinate them. What I need to do is get this gone so it stops hurting me as much. Winning battles, though, can give you some prestige, so I feel like maybe going after Moldavia is the right play here. It's my war... Do I have war exhaustion at all? I probably don't. I haven't been in the war in a while. No. no. So that's good. You guys really like me. I'm going to treat you as a strong alliance for now. But it's still the white blob that's worrisome. Oh, and in case anyone forgets, France is under Russia in a personal union. Because, you know, <laughs> England is still unable to unify. That's not bad. Really? That just makes no sense to me. Uh, well, those are useful right now. Let's see. Build province improvements. I can still build more constables. I've got like four more. Okay. I'm getting close to maxing constables and temples. And we will likely pause after that. Where's our tech? We should be really close. Brandenburg is once again the emperor. Even though there are two provinces, Austria is much bigger. Everyone likes Brandenburg. Hey. Um, we're still two years ahead here and here. So basically what's going to happen is we're going to get those techs the minute it drops to regular. Um, and then hopefully get an idea or two out of it as well because we're really close here. And Diplo ideas, better diplomatic re reputation isn't bad. And a permanent cost of spelly versus other government types, which I don't know if that's useful to me. Um, we are... No, view my country. What are we? We're a feudal monarchy. How can I tell it? Merchant Republic, Archbishop, Brick, Duchy, Noble Republic. So, there's some people here I could attack if I wanted to. Uh, just not sure how useful that's going to be. Danzig? No. So we're gonna probably leave someone in Danzig for now. Did I gain the claim on Moldovia yet? Nope. Yeah, at this point you should distrust me. Let's, there we can see what happens. So now, if I get Get war against Moldavia. Royal marriage of Saxony. That's fine. Um, 
zero, or I would lose a negative stability. They have no allies. So I'd go to negative three stability, which is really annoying. It's not the worst thing in the world. <laughs> Basically, just want to take them over <laughs> um, and get them back to my land. So let's start raising our maintenance. Because clearly it's time. Archery versus muskets. I don't want to have that. No. Even if it's not useful. Hi, Tom Shark. Hope you're doing well. Ah, where to go? Okay. And we're in a long autosave. One free diplomat who we want to keep free for now. Should start losing money, which is brilliant. Alright, so we are getting closer. Uh, yes, except Danzig is back to as high as it can be. I'm gonna take them out. <laughs> it's gonna happen. I love to reduce inflation, but um, in fact, how close are we? Still, you're two years ahead. Okay. All right. Keep another tick or two more, then we'll go after them. <coughs> for a better place to improve relations right now. But I've done it in a lot of places lately. Let's try Tuscany. Um, improve relations with one of the diplomats. And then you still don't have any allies, right? Yep, so one more tick, or two more ticks, maybe. Um, well, we're going to get in there. But it means we have to shuffle our forces over here. Pray that Austria doesn't get into this war. Bohemia, Brandenburg, Hesse, and Mainz. Okay. I'm not worried about any of those, really. Yay, minus 10 tech cost. Getting exciting here. In fact, we're about hmm, half a minute from having to start this, the end this video. So we're going to do that. I think we've got a war against Bohemia and Brandenburg and... Hessa and Mines. Where's Hessa? Over here. Palinate, Palinate. Mines is down here. H Tria, Hessa. So pretty much tiny little things. We're gonna definitely go after them. I'm not too worried about that war. And then maybe we'll swing back around here and get Moldovia. We'll see how it goes. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good night.